and you are watching What's Up in Makeup. Oh my goodness, so much stuff to tell you, so let's get right into it. First of all, the balm is back on hold, look. The balm is one of my absolute favorite makeup brands of all time, and I always get very excited to see them on hold, look. Everything is 50% off until early Tuesday morning. For Mother's Day, IT Cosmetics has come out with a new kit called the XOXO Beautiful You Set. It is $55. It comes with a travel cosmetics bag, a Hello Lashes 5-in-1 mascara, a Vitality Lip Flush Lipstick Butter in the shade In Love, Your Lips But Better Waterproof Lip Liner Stain in the shade Romantic Rose, and the Hello Light Anti-Aging Luminizing Cream Stick. In super creative news, Lipstick Queen founder Poppy King presents Frog Prince, an olive green lipstick that transforms lips into a rosebud pink shade. The green reacts with the warmth of, warmth of your lips, turning them an intense fairy tale rose, while vitamin E and shea butter keep lips soft and hydrated. But if you want the same effect without the $25 price tag, you can just Google color changing lipstick and you'll find color changing lipsticks between $3 and $8 a piece. You can find sets of many of them for $20. But you don't get the cool lipstick with the frog prince backstory. In Sephora news, Sephora Favorites has come out with a new sampler kit called the Time to Prime. It's $25. It's a complete primer set to prep the face, eyes, lashes, nails, hair, and lips. It contains deluxe size samples of the Bite Beauty Line and Define Primer, the Formula X Prime Base Coat, the Hourglass Veil Mineral Primer in Broad Spectrum SPF 15, the Living Proof Prime Style Extender for your hair, and the Smashbox 24-Hour Photo Finish Shadow Primer and the Urban Decay Subversion Lash Primer. Clinique also has a kit called the Spring Into Color. It is $39.50, and it comes with a limited edition all about shadow, eyeshadow quad, a lash power feathering mascara in black onyx, a chubby stick baby tint moisturizing lip color balm in Pop and Poppy, a chubby stick cheek color balm in Robust Rhubarb, and a moisture Surge Extended Thirst Relief. Oh, and then you get a makeup bag too. Bare Minerals has added some kits to their collection that are very similar to the Estee Lauder Double Wear collection we talked about last week in What's Up in Makeup. The first one is the 20th Anniversary Collector's Edition Original Foundation Kit. You have a choice of eight shades of foundation. It's $38. You get a full-size original foundation and a beautiful finished brush. And just so you know, that foundation has over 14,000 five-star ratings on Sephora's website. Insane. The second kit by Bare Minerals is the Experience Bare Skin 3-Piece Introductory Collection. You have a choice of 8 shades. You get a half a size, so it's a deluxe sample of Bare Skin Pure Brightening Serum Foundation in Broad Spectrum SPF 20, a Bare Skin Perfecting Veil, and a Bare Skin Perfecting Face Brush. Anastasia Beverly Hills is going to make a lot of makeup artists happy with their Pro Palette. It's $88, but you get 11 full-size brow powder duo shades and a brow primer in that kit. Becca has a new Luminous Body Perfecting Mousse. It's $34. It's a skin perfector that conceals imperfections and seamlessly even skin tone with subtle radiance and a true bronze color. Givenchy has a few products that are now available from their brand, and I'm going to just put the text here because I don't want to butcher the name. This one is $49. It is a fluid and weightless glowing foundation that sprays on in an instant for an even tanned look. And also the La Rouge A Porter. They are a new version of Givenchy's original La Rouge formula in a sheer coverage balm. They're formulated with hyaluronic acid, and it comes in a genuine leather case. There are 16 shades, and and they are $36 each. Derma Blend also has a few new products, including the Cover Cream Broad Spectrum SPF. It's $38. It comes in 21 shades. They call it a best-selling cream foundation that provides reliable, flawless, and full coverage with a velvety smooth finish. Also, a smooth liquid camo foundation that's $35 in 10 shades, and they call that a liquid foundation that provides medium coverage. And then the Derma Blend Loose Setting Powder for $26. Tony Moly has, of course, a very cute product. This this is called the Pocket Bunny Sleek Mist. It's $15 and it's an oil controlling face mist that helps counteract excessive oil production while providing refreshing hydration. YSL has a healthy glow balm powder for $55. It gives you a glow without looking muddy or overly shimmery. It comes in five shades and also comes with a brush. YSL has also come out with a brand new plump up glossy stain. They say that it is a long wear lip plumper that offers shine, wear, and volume. It's it's called a glossy stain, but it doesn't seem to have any pigmentation. Hmm. 
Guerlain came out with a Terracotta Sun Glow Kit for $53. It's a classic bronzer with a light texture and a natural finish in a limited edition compact with a brush. And Dior has a new version of their Dior Show Mascara. It comes in black, brown, blue, or purple. They call it a renewed version of the classic backstage mascara featuring a formula enriched with microfibers. The microfibers cling between the lashes to thicken naturally without clumping. Wax texture coats lashes for buildable volume and then they have a patented airlock wiper prevents the formula from being in contact with air keeping the mascara from drying in the tube therefore thereby allowing for fresh application day after day it's currently listed as coming soon on the Sephora website but it looks like it will when it does come out it'll only be available to VIB and VIB Rouge members NARS's Christopher Kane collection has landed at Sephora but you can't get the entire collection for the full collection go to NARS.com at Sephora they do have the duo eyeshadow in parallel universe and the four shades of lip gloss and two shades of blush in starscape and silent nude in sephora nail polish news formula x now has a limited edition the cut collection for summer of 2015 and there are seven very very vibrant shades in contrast deborah lipman is going the neutral route with the paint and desert collection in five earth tone shades if you want a little brighter from deborah lipman though we also have the calypso nail lacquer duet for 19 you get two mini nail lacquers in that set, including a sea foam glitter finish and a mint medley cream finish polish. Nails Inc. Is came out with a very interesting line of polishes. They're called the Baby Kale Collection. It is a trio of treatments supercharged with kale extract to nourish, strengthen, and illuminate nails. I'm wondering how the nails actually will be illuminated because I think like that they're going to infuse actual light into the nails. I just don't get that. Uh, I just can't visualize it. The Nail Kale Superfood Base Coat, the Nail Kale Illuminator, and the Nail Kale Color in Mayfair Lane. I did check the ingredients and I'll list what the actual kale ingredient is here, uh, but it's way down in the ingredient list, but maybe you don't need a lot of kale extract, extract for it to be effective. I don't know, but still very interesting. <laughs> Emily Inside Sephora has a couple of updates for us inside her store. The Urban Decay Enigma Eyeshadow Primer is in stores now. 100% of retail sales go toward an organization which funds global women empowerment. Also, Sephora now has Ultra Lip Shine Glosses. They're $14. They're in a new formula with new packaging and new colors. There's 18 shades. Also, she cannot stop talking about these colorful blushes. She said she swatched them. They're amazing amazing these sephora collection blushes they're 15 dollars each there's 18 shades i want to put my fingers in them and try them mark jacobs also has a couple of his new products that have landed in stores including the enamored high shine lip lacquers in 18 shades and the gel eye crayons in six new shades kat von d's tattoo liner in the brown shade has also made it to stores along with the lancome miracle cushion liquid cushion compact foundation and you can also buy refills for that which i think is pretty interesting Interesting. Also, Bessame Cosmetics has come out with a new brightening violet powder. I've been using the vanilla one and absolutely loving it, so curious to see how the, van the violet one is going to work. And also, they're always trying to give you those travel size items at the checkout. They have a bunch of new travel size items, including the Primer Water by Smashbox, the Makeup Forever Step 1 Primers, and the Bare Minerals Gloss on the Go Kit. In high-end news, Burberry has a new Lip and Cheek Bloom in six shades. They're $28 and they have a buildable matte finish. Chanel has come out with their summer collection. It is called the Mediterranean Collection for summer of 2015. Lots of stuff in this collection, so bear with me. They have a golden bronze bronzer, and I will put the name here for you because I don't want to butcher it. They've also re-released their Stylo Eyeshadow Sticks. They're shimmering and long-wearing, but Lily, our high-end reporter, wants to warn you that she has tried these and she feels like the Laura Mercier Caviar Sticks are less expensive expensive and much, much more amazing when it comes to pigmentation and lasting power. So beware of that. They also have the Stylo U, I'm going to say Y-E-U-X waterproof eyeliner in a purple shade and four new nail polishes in a taupe color, a purple color, a teal, and a red. Also the Rouge Coco Shine lipsticks in four new shades. Only one, the beige one on the left there is limited edition. And then finally two new lip glosses in a pink, red, and a rose the rose colored one on the right is limited edition Woo! 
hang in there. We got lots of Mac news coming because it came out with some new collections. All right, we have the one that has not been released yet, which is the Guo Pei collection. I hope I'm saying that right for 2000. And she brings elegance to MAC, an inspired collection of hues, merging vibrant jewel tones with lush neutrals punctuated by deep graphite online and in stores, they just say later this year. And you can, I, I'm really curious what that's going to end up looking like. The one that is coming out very soon is the Wash and Dry collection that's coming out online on May 14th and in stores in North America on the 21st and then sometime in May for International. For lipsticks, there's going to be four shades in this packaging. Two are from the permanent collection and two are limited edition. The limited edition shades are called Steam Heat and it's a vivid yellow red and then Tumble Dry Light which is a pe peachy coral luster finish. Some lip glasses. One is a repromote called Girl On Board. It's a light cream nude. One is called Laundry List which is a vivid orange and Hot Cold which is a true red and then Domestic Diva which is a frosty watery pink. Next are some technical liners and practice makes perfect, which is a deep blue green sudsy, which is a marine blue color matters, which is a lime, which is a repromote and then coin operated, which is a metal gray with silver pearl in it. Next up are some Velux pearl fusion shadow trios. There's going to be three of them. One is called warm wash white with orange, peach and copper shades. Then there's green clean, which are is a pale white green, a lime and a khaki and then permanent press, which is a white beige, brown bronze, and a black with gold pearl flex. There are two blushes. First one is new. It's called Crisp Whites. It's a pale tangerine with pearl. And then a repromote called Hypnos Light, which is a peach. There's a highlighter called Freshen Up. The color wave that you can see in there ranges from coral to neutral. Two new nail lacquers in Monday Blues, which is a blue, and a and Washteria, which is a blue green. They are both cream finishes. Five shades of Fluid Line Brow Gel Creams from Deep Dark Brunette to Ash Blonde Pale. Some eyebrow pencils in a red brown and ash gray brown, a taupe, and a stylized brown. A Studio Sculpt Defining Bronzing Powder in Delicates Neutral, which is a deep bronze with fine gold shimmer. Golden Rinse, which is a light brick reddish bronze with fine shimmer and two I'm, I'm still going I'm still going girlfriend this is a big collection two bronzing powders from the permanent line called refined golden and matte bronze six pro long wear waterproof brow sets from the permanent line that are going to be in that packaging and then two limited edition brushes one is the 125 split fiber dense face brush it's 3850 and then the 126 split fiber large face brush for 46 dollars then finally Finally, the makeup bag, which is $35 in the same print. Uh, that is limited edition. You can get the bag online and also in select Mac stores. Mac is done. Let's move on to some drugstore. All right. I think we're ready for some drugstore. NYC is coming out with new Expert Last matte lip colors. They are $2 each in the shades Smooth Beige, Creamy Mauve, Pure Coral, Velvety Fuchsia, and Red Suede. They are launching sometime in May and very excited to see those. At Walgreens, the limited edition Soho Beauty and the Beast collection has a Arrived. The bags are already showing up at Walgreens and soon after they're coming out with the elf makeup that's going to go along with that Beauty and the Beast theme. Rimmel has come out with a new Rita Ora collection. They have some very risque names so I am warning you ahead of time. The names are very NARS-like. Okay, you'll see why. The nail polishes are $1.69. They are in Orgasm, Let's Get Nude, Blindfold Me Blue, Pillow Talk, Raw As Night, Rita Rouge and Pop or Top Coat. The lip colors are going to be $5.49 each. They're called Give Me a Cuddle, The Redder, The Better, I Want Candy, Boom Chicka Boom, and On Fire. Woo! Sally Hansen came out with a new collection called the Cosmopolitan Beachside Astrologer. There are 12 shades, one for each astrological sign. Very exciting if you're looking for dupes. Profusion is coming out with some new Glamour Bar eyeshadow palettes. They basically look like the chocolate bar palettes, 
but cheaper. There are three palettes, each are $4.99. They've been spotted at Kmart's. You can get you get 15 shades, one eyeliner, and one double-ended sponge applicator with each palette. We couldn't find any official pictures and we couldn't just steal them off of blogs. But if you look it up, N Nouveau Cheap has pictures of it on their website. Revlon has new limited edition Sahara Escape color collection products. We've only found them as a picture on Instagram so far, but there is a color stay 16 hour eyeshadow quad called Surreal, and then also a Revlon bronzer palette in Desert Bronze, four new nail polishes, and four new shades of the super lustrous lip glosses. In QVC news, there is going to be a Kate Somerville TSV, or Today's Special Value, on May 4th and it is called the Kate Somerville Super Size Exfoliate and Dermal Quench for $179.95 plus $3 shipping and handling. And what you get is you get an exfoliate, it's intensive exfoliating treatment and dermal quench liquid oxygen treatment. You get one five fluid ounce exfoliate and then a 0.5 ounce exfoliate. Then you get a five ounce dermal quench and a 0.5 ounce dermal quench. They can't ship to Alaska, Hawaii, Puerto Rico, the Virgin Islands, or Guam, just so you know. But that's very, very interesting. Five ounces is a lot of product. Also, Wander Beauty has an on-the-glow blush and illuminator duo stick for $35 that's on their website right now. You have a choice of two colors. Bare Minerals has a deluxe 20th anniversary foundation with brush for $41.82 plus the $3 shipping and handling. Now, this is very interesting. I'm not sure if you've ever heard of Doll 10. I think I've heard of them but it's not resonating with me for some reason. Doll 10 has a system called the Blend Smart Rotating Brush System. So what you do is you plug your brush into the top and it rotates for you. So almost like an electric toothbrush, it just kind of does the work for you. So there is a foundation brush set that comes with the system where you get the base and that's $60 plus $3 shipping and handling. Um, and it rotates the entire 360 degrees. They say that it's perfect for liquid cream or powder foundations. You can also get different brush heads. There's two different brush heads available. Now, if you already have that set, that kit, or if you want to add on some other brushes, they also have a blush brush for $22 and a powder brush for $22. So if you're interested in that, that is also available on QVC's website. In Andy brand news, ColourPop has come out with some highlighters. I'm not sure. I don't know a lot about ColourPop, so I'm not sure which ones are brand new. I'm just going to show you all of the shades right here that come up when I click the link about the new highlighters. They are $18 each and there's 15 shades listed. And I thank special reporter Leanne for this tip on the ColourPop collection. I really appreciate it. And then for MBA Cosmetics, there are a few new products, including the Compact Cream Foundations. There are 16 shades available. The packaging is a black bi-level compact with a mirror and a sponge applicator. There are also these gorgeous blushing bouquet blushes. There are six shades available for those. So, so pretty. And then the Perfect Brow Waterproof Mineral Brow Pencils. There's four shades available in those. A friend of mine, Maria from Agape Love Girl, has a 15% off discount code. I will link that down below. In makeup events news, Nordstrom's got a bunch of things going on in May. They may not be available in all areas, so make sure you check your local Nordstrom to make sure they are available at your particular location. The first one is the Bobbi Brown Sandy Nudes event. It's from May 6th through May 9th, and they say you work one-on-one -on -one with the Bobbi Brown team as they take you through a Bobbi Brown makeup lesson, suggesting products to create a beautiful yet effortless summer look. You receive a deluxe longwear cream shadow stick, a $38 value, with a purchase of $75 or more while supplies last. But definitely call the Bobbi Brown Cosmetics counter for your reservation for that. Also, there is the Chanel National Makeup Artist event on May 7th. It's from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. You you can meet Chanel National Makeup Artists to show you luxury skincare and makeup products and offer you personalized recommendations for a new look. Definitely call your Chanel Cosmetics counter to schedule an appointment. Also, Sephora has a bunch of new classes available, but they definitely vary per location. Some of the classes include the Party Ready Smoky Eye, the False Lashes class, which I need to take, the Skincare Basics class, the Day to Night Smoky Eye, the Flawless Foundation, Perfectly Paired 
Hair, Lips, and Cheeks, and a contouring and highlighting class. In sales and deals, 6 p.m. has Pop Beauty items, 40 to 50% off. I will link that down below. Also for you OPI fans, Living Social has a deal. You get $40 worth of products in a cute bag for $20. There is a Paris-themed cosmetic bag filled with supplies you need to create flawless nails. You get a nail file, two toe separators, a matte nail envy nail strengthener, a top coat, and a Live Love Carnival nail polish. Also at Living Social, if you enjoy Butter London products, they have a $25 for $40 worth of products deal. Also, if you've been looking to try some e.l.f. products, there is a huge bundle deal. You get an e.l.f. Cosmetics Beauty Clutch and a 10-piece brush set. It's a $40 value for $14. You get the Beauty Clutch, which includes 32 eyeshadows, 6 lip colors, 2 blushes, a bronzer, an eyebrow powder, an eyebrow cream, a face shimmer, and 3 dual-ended eyeshadow applicators. Also, 10 assorted makeup brushes for that $14 price tag. One sale that keeps selling out, even though that isn't a big discount, is the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Eyeshadow Collection. It's $46 instead of $50 on the website, so you get a little bit of a deal. And that's it for What's Up in Makeup this week. I hope you enjoyed the show this week. Thank you, as always, to our What's Up in Makeup reporters, Lily Spurgeon, Susan W., Naomi at Naomi the Giveaway Queen, Emily at Tea Time with Emily, Nicole at Yay or Nay with Nicole, Maria at Agape Love Girl, and our special reporter, Leanne. Thank you for your work this week. I really appreciate all of your help. And we are going to have a chat again this week. So if you are tuning in around 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, we will be chatting from 10 a.m. to 11 a.m. in our pajamas, drinking our coffee, chatting about makeup, saving everybody some money so that we can have the most informed beauty purchases. And I'm so excited to hang out with you all again this morning. So I will leave the information for that down in the description below if you'd like to come chat with us. So again, I thank you so much for watching Mad Love, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! I'm gonna rewind. I don't like that at all. This is not starting off well. No, it's not. Okay. Anti-aging, luminizing cream stick to help your mother look as young as she once did. That was rude. To help your mother feel that anti-aging. <laughs> That's terrible. I'm a mom, I'm allowed to say these things. Anastasia Beverly Hills is going to make a lot of makeup artists happy with their Bro Pro, Bro Pro, really? Bro Pro? Givenchy has a couple of new products this week, including the Broom Bon Min. I'm gonna be editing forever. <laughs>